elk roam the forests of Pennsylvania. The population of elk, however, would be haunted until none remained in the state. In 1912, the Game Commission would begin to discuss the idea of reintroducing elk in Pennsylvania. A year later, in 1913, Pennsylvania would receive its first shipment of elk by train. received cost about $30 each. Later that year, another 22 elk would be shipped as well. Two years later, in 1915, 95 more elk were bought in from Yellowstone. Throughout the next 60 years or so, for many different reasons, including sickness, hunting, and farmers killing the elk because of crop damages, the herd would see their numbers fluctuate and at times plummeting very low. Many restrictions were to be put in place limiting the number of elk that were to be legally killed, and fines would be created for those killed illegally. In the 1980s, the number of elk was around 120 to 150 animals, and in 1992, 205 were counted.
could see significant growth, bringing the herd size to an estimated 566 animals, more than doubling previous counts. It's estimated as of 2020, the population is now between 1,000 to 1,200 elk. Many people travel here to western Pennsylvania each year to see them, especially in the autumn during the rut season, where the largest bull elk challenge each other for the right to breed. lambs, but they continue to adapt and maintain a strong presence in an area where they once roamed free. <laughs> 